Hi, I'm Stefan Brogren. Uh, this is the principal's office. I'm not wearing socks. So we're talking about, sorry, I'm doing my shoelaces at the same time. We're talking about uh, 1316. And uh, this is, uh, this is for me as a, as a fan of the show, watching the show, I, something that like I, it's, this is a rough one. It's the end of Bianca and Drew. I don't feel like that girl anymore. I've changed. And I haven't? University has opened my mind to so much opportunity. There's so much I want to see and do. You know, I've talked about this before as far as people moving on and discovering themselves when they, when they go to school, go away to school. And there's a part of me that goes, Bianca deserves that chance to, to move on for a little bit and discover herself. You know, it's, she's always been a very intelligent girl. You know, we've, we've watched her come from sort of like this skitty kind of chick that was taken in by the Torres family a little bit. Drew's like saved her life a couple times. And, uh, and there's really been a real true love between the two of them. And now she's moved on and she's actually gonna, there's a possibility of this, this girl that came from sort of like the wrong side of the tracks to really being something great. Not that Drew would hold her back, but she needs to discover what that person is. That's my true feeling on it. And uh, as heartbreaking as it is, I actually find it kind of heartbreaking that these two are breaking up because, you know, Drianka, they're awesome. It's something that she needs to do. You look at her and you go, she's becoming a woman. And she needs to like make that next step. And Drew, in a lot of ways, is still a boy. And, uh, which means he should really just start making out with Claire. How much do you hate us? You hate us so much. We break your mind. We break your mind.